hello everyone welcome back in this video i'm going to show you how to make a minimal logo animation using adobe after effects so before starting this tutorial i would like to invite you to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to get all of my new videos notification so now let's have a look what we will create today So this is the animation we are going to make in this video and now let's get started with this tutorial. So first open your After Effects then go to Composition and create a new composition. I am going with 1920 pixel by 1080 pixel and I am going with 5 second duration and you can rename it to main or anything you want. I'm going with custom background color is black hit ok now let's create a new background here right click go to new then create a solid and change its color to something like this or any color you want and I'm going to rename it to BG for background hit ok you can also apply a fill effect here to change its background anytime and you can change its color to something like this now from here let's create a rectangle so go to here then right click and select the rectangular tool turn off the fill from here then select the stroke and stroke i am going to use 8 pixel then from here turn on the title save action then go to this center right click then press ctrl and shift make a circle like this ok I am going to change its color to black this time and now let's animate this so first of all click here and then go to add and add a trim path from here and go to trim path and you can animate this like this but here you can see this this is the we'll make this round so to make this round go to rectangle then select the stroke and from here line cap select the round cap this also round chain then close this and back to the trim path make it 100% we will first animate the end properties then the start properties so make the end 0 then create a keyframe here now go to around 30 frame then make it to 100% and also make this to 100% here and create a keyframe go to here and make it to 0 now select this keyframes drag this to here now you can see this is the animation for now but you can always adjust the timing from here now let's see the preview select all of this keyframe and right click on your mouse go to keyframe assistant and make them easy is or you can press F9 from your keyboard now click this speed graph then select all of them make this something like this now let's see this is our animation for now okay now i am going to rename it to black line now select this press ctrl d to duplicate it and rename it to white now select this and go to stroke change its color to white and 
select this and make this something like this and go to stroke and change it to 6 or maybe 5 Now press U to open keyframes, drag them to here. Okay, this is our animation now. Now let's import our logo here. Go to here, right, drag this logo to the composition and you can rename this composition to logo now back to the main composition and drag the logo to this composition now go to this point select the logo press R and create a keyframe here back to here and set it to minus 65 or something more maybe 95 and press S here create a keyframe and make it to zero here now let's see the preview ok now select all of this keyframe and press F9 to make them easy or so right click on your mouse go to keyframe assistant then select easy -ease. now select the graph editor then select this by the way if your graph editor don't show like this then right click and select this edit speed graph then click here select this and make this something like this now let's see So this is our animation now. Now let's add our text. So before adding text, let's adjust something. Select all of these shapes and drag them something like here. Now right click, create a new text and type your title here. drag this to here and you can align it to the center and again apply fill effect here and change its color to this black or any color you want now go to here and select the text press p to open position create a keyframe here back to something like here and drag this to this point and press T to open opacity create a keyframe make it to 0 and press U go to here make it to 100% select all of them and again make them as it is and also make this and now select the text and drag them below of this line so now let's see the preview now you can add some another text here go to new create text type your text now go to character and you can resize it drag this to here and 
you can change this to ball to light or maybe regular then select this press ctrl D to duplicate it and drag them here select this and change this to light you can also apply fill here and change its color to black now select this text pre-compose and rename it to bottom text let's animate this select this press T and opposite is it to 0 go to here and make it to 100% and make them as is so this is our animation now we can turn off the title and save action You can always change the text color and stroke color anytime from anywhere. So now it's time to render our project. So to render this, go to composition, then select the add to render queue. Then from here, select lossless and select quick time. Then from here, select S264, hit OK. And from here, must select RGB then hit ok now select output folder from here hit save now just click on this render button and now just click on this render button it will start rendering your video so hope you enjoy this video if you enjoy this then make sure that you like this video and subscribe this channel and don't forget to share this video with your friend I'll be back with new videos soon. Till then, take care. Goodbye.